And hello again. Welcome back. It's Pokemon Platinum. Of course. Oh, I actually still have a repel going on. Awesome. That'll probably wear off in like five more steps or something. Anyway, um, in this part, we're going to be actually starting the ice, the ice routes of Sin, the snow routes of Sinnoh, technically. Not really ice. Well, there's a lot of ice Pokemon, but okay, there it is. Okay, now we'll reset the Super Repel. Yay! We're gonna go down here. And I actually have switched around some Pokemon a little bit. Okay. Game. Yeah, don't. I don't have Torterra with me. Because we need Defog. If we're gonna look around this area. Hmm. Okay, there is an item here. Let's grab this real quick. Break the rock. Green shard. Terrific. Now, there are a lot of items, I think, in this room, and some are hidden, which I'm not going to bother finding. For, um, since I don't really have a good way of... Okay, there was the best one, the blue shard. There we go. I'm guessing there is one of each shard in the room. I'm not looking for all of them. I really only needed the blue shard, to be honest. So, I got the best one. Hooray. But yeah, now we're just going to be exploring this little area of water and stuff. Um, there are some important items to find find in here, I guess. Well, not massively important, but okay, soft sand. That's pretty good for you if you have a ground type. But, um, the big thing is actually uh, in, well, not really big, big, but it's it's important. There's actually a new Pokemon in this room, and it's this is the only place in the game you can get it. However, it is also really annoying to get. It is Feebas. One tile. Well, no, there's like four tiles on the lake that Feebas will appear in. That doesn't sound too bad. Then we add in the fact that said tiles are random, randomized daily. Like, every single day, it'll reset and, and switch them around, and you can only find it with the old rod. Add a... Not and not as a 100% chance of finding it either. So it's one of the worst Pokemon to find in this game. <laughs> it's actually really annoying. And this is not Melo. And this, I'm trying to decide which which of these is the worst for Melotic to get Melotic in, because this one's up there. Although not only that, but it's also the way you evolve it is through beauty contests. As if we needed any other reasons why Feebass is a pain in the butt. Yeah, you need to have its uh, contest stats, like, maxed out in beauty for some ungodly reason. Because, you know, it couldn't just evolve with an item or something. <laughs> Which it later does. That's the best part. Later on, when we get to um, later games, they change it. Super Repel again. You know, I added, like, how many Repels? I actually got this already, haven't I? Yeah, okay. Um, there we go. And here we out. Into Route 216. There's a lot we can do up here now. Like, get a power point up right here. But yeah, now we have access to... Getting a bunch of items here. Full heal, okay. Um, cause... This is the snow route. Now that we can't go to without rock climb. And there are a lot of ice trainers! I haven't switched team members yet. Well, it's time! Remember when I said Sharon was gonna have a freaking field day? Oh boy, most of the trainers here use ice types. 
It's time to get cooking. Oh, come on! The first one's a gold duck! <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have a field day. Later. <laughs> I probably could still win, but I'm going to switch to Shari and... Spam hidden power instead because I don't want to do I don't I I don't have Torterra with me and I really don't have any electric po moves yet. It's like uh gold duck. No, <laughs> I don't want to deal with water types. Okay. Are we done yet? <sighs> Hail continues to fall. I'm gonna take damage from that, of course. Uh, Ace trainer send out pseudo Budo. Oh, the best part is, is that Shari is low health. So back to the beeps. Dunna, 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 dunna. Can't wait till they remove this feature, because I know they do later on in the series, but not in this game. In this game, that's still apparent and annoying as heck. So shut up. Uh, Sudo Udo at least gets taken down in one hit. Okay, this trainer's kind of a jerk. It's like, oh boy, ice root full of ice types and stuff. Eh. <laughs> starts in, in she starts with a water type then a rock type like uh and then a fire type <laughs> really you know what screw you <laughs> uh and the worst part is i could go back and go get torterra but i don't want to walk all the way back that's a lot of editing that I don't really want to do. I just want to kill it and be done. Good God, screw you, Ace Trainers. Yeah, you're not even. Yeah, an ice variation of the Ace Trainer. With, you know, really can uh, you know has warm clothing and stuff, and is also kind of a jerk. And uh. anyway, I don't have that many Moomin also left. I'm noticing, huh? I could have technically used eliminate on that, but I don't I think I have any. Let's heal up Shari. Uh, I will quickly give a, a sh potion to Shari as well. Now, hopefully that's the only one, because I don't think there's any other trainers that... Use Gold Duck. I got Gold Duck. Because uh, most of the trainers use Ice types. Except apparently that one. At least that's what I remember. Granted, I don't remember this place that perfectly well, but. Uh, come on. Napel's effect wore off. Oh, great. And we got a Ace Trainer. What the actual heck? <laughs> Lol, get wrecked. Okay, I think it's the skiers who mostly use ice types. But they also toss in ace trainers just to be a complete pain. Uh, at least you I can attack with flamethrower. Burn. <laughs> I don't even have anything good to take down Ambipom. Because Ambipom's a normal type. And I don't have any fighting moves at any of my team members. I do have Brick Break I could teach, but I don't really want to teach that. But yeah, at least they're interesting Pokemon, I suppose. Ow. Ow. Please don't faint. Wow. Jared survives. Return attack, sucker. Yeah. Jared lives. Oh, frick, a hailstorm. <laughs> no, no, don't faint from the hail. No. God damn it. <laughs> uh. 
Okay, Ty is probably the better chances here because of his ice type. Porygon 2! Huh. Uh, you trace Keen Eye, which is gonna be kind of useless for ya. Uh, Ice Punch. Yeah, this, Porygon 2, that's an interesting choice. Conversion 2. What type are you switching to? You switch to Water type? Why? Oh, you're still gonna be affected by Hail, though. At least we'll be taking hail damage, and I can just switch to Faint Attack, which should do pretty equal amounts of damage. Possibly more, actually, due to the black glasses. You have Recover! Ugh! I hate this godforsaken Pokemon. Why? Porygon 2, I hate you. The best part is I don't really have much that's gonna really do good again. Oh, come on! Recover spam is annoying and you're not doing anything. I'm going to win inevitably. I have 20 faint attacks. You have 10 recovers. You cannot do this. You are totally just going to spam that until you feel like you are safe enough to use an actual attack. But no matter what, if I can get two good hits, I should be able to kill it. Uh, you're still water type, too. So, uh, again, you're all water. That actually adds to it. It switched to being a water type. Also, ow. Ow. No. No. You're gonna recover again if you if I freaking miss. No, die. Please, die. Don't miss. Yes! Fate attack. And by miss, I mean, you know, hit self. But, um, critical hit. Could have used that earlier, but, uh, eh. Okay. Did it. Of course, by the way, I got a critical hit when I didn't need one. Uh, boy, that was not fun either. And what's with all the Pokemon that I don't want that are not what I expect? Like, it's a water root. It's a ice root. Use ice types. In fact, I remember a lot of ice types. That they use a lot of ice types here. Where are they? <laughs> I think... I think we'll be seeing more when we hit the, um, uh, having a lot more of the skier, uh, trainer class. There are quite a few of those coming up in the second part, uh, second of the ice routes here. And that one should, that trainer class should be pretty exclusively ice type. Hopefully. I'm hoping there's no more freaking gold decks. What? <laughs> well, Jaren will have a field day on this fight, but uh, still, what? What? Why? Why a Tropius? I mean, granted, it's a cool Pokemon. Okay. Okay. Ugh. I just want Sharon to wreck space. And in fact, Jaren will. He's going to get the ice gem. He's going to eat the ice gem, practically. It's such an easy one for him. Because everything's ice type in there. There are no ice water types, if I'm correct, in Sinnoh at all. There is nothing to stop him, essentially, when he we get to the next gym. The next gym is going to be Jaren barbecues the place and picks up the gym badge for me. Like, it's not gonna be hard. Oh, finally a skier. You better have ice types. <laughs> well, there is one ice type that technically could counter fi a fire type. 
being ice gra- Yes! You have a Sneasel! Ugh. There's been so many ice types that should uh burn. What? <laughs> wow. <laughs> beat up. <laughs> if I'm correct, I think that was beat up. No, that did effing nothing. Because duh. <laughs> beat up suck. Beat up is weird as heck and how it does its damage. And honestly, it's kind of a garbage move. You're just better off with a dark move like Fan Attack or Night Slash than Beat Up. Beat Up just doesn't work that well. Um, there's one more trainer there. I'll fight him now. And then I'll go into that house. I'll do this first. Oh, wait, it's 18 minutes. Mr. Mime? What? <laughs> now... Uh, now that I think about it, for this one, I'm going to go for Return Attack instead of Shadow Ball. Okay, maybe I should have went for Shadow Ball. Uh, Return Attack. You should have gone Uh, freaking Reflect Barrier. Okay, Reflect raises defense of the entire team for five turns. Yay. Shadow Ball. Die. Oh, you're gonna return it. You're gonna get return attack. Well, okay. <laughs> Shadow ball. <laughs> I'm going to kill you this turn, so it's not like it matters too much. Okay. Just gotta get through the level 42. Not there yet, of course, but eh, it's gonna be. I'll get it by the end of this read easily. I mean, Jaren has so many opportunities. Theoretic. Scyther? <laughs> What is with this route and having no actual I having like so far the trainers have had one ice type one of course the trainer class that is the ice trainer oh come on great Scyther's faster well that that's not massively surprising but uh, my health was already really low uh Ty you know what wreck just wreck everything. Ice punch, screw you. Ugh, freaking slash attack. I that's not good. That's really not good. Wait. Well! Scyther's showing why Scyther's a cool Pokemon. Jesus! I mean, when it evolves, it doesn't even has a stat diff the difference in stats are they get shifted around if I'm correct. Like, it barely... I don't even think it goes up. But still, screw you! Uh, well, I'm gonna go heal in a second, but Jesus! Die! <laughs> Cross poison! Get right. Oh, come on! If this criticals, it kills me. Okay, thank fuck. Oh, yeah, that's why! Reflect helped you immensely. Ah. Uh, Come on! Die, you stupid Scyther! You have a third Pokemon, too! And I'm going, like, way over time. If I'm correct. Ugh! Screw you, Scyther! Dysclops! Well, um... Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm going to send Shari out and spam Surf now, because I don't want to deal with you. Yeah, uh, Dusclops is a coast type. We have had one ice type so far on this route. Thankfully, there's, like, another route after this that is mostly the skiers who do use ice types. Which then Jaren can actually have fun, but... Oh, God. It, it's been catching me off guard with freaking... Like, oh, the freaking... Uh, just... Just die! Screw you, you're getting cutted! See you guys next part!